it is April 2nd. Here's the first Malachite Caddisfly case uh, that we started viewing uh, last week. I think this would be day five of his building. And he's almost done. And of course, he's taking his time. Um, it's getting, I put him on top of these leaves so he's not quite in the water all the way. So he's trying to get back down into the water here. As you're looking around the leaves, around this case, you can see caddisflies have been quite hungry and doing their job of breaking down leaf material. And he's digging himself back down into the water. And he's trying to get out of the limelight. I think he's tired of always being filmed, but um, I'm trying to keep track of the building timeline and how, how many stones they're putting on at a time. And they do like to um, work kind of slowly. Over to the right there you can see a caddisfly who has not started transitioning quite yet and um, is in his full leaf case still. Here's the malachite bin and we got some major active dudes going on right now. They're, they're um, all in different levels of construction. They're cruising around the leaf mass here. This guy's trying to get up on top of there. Um, the cases are looking really cool, very pretty. Malachite's always a really popular stone for the jewelry enthusiasts. And uh, my caddisflies are really working hard to provide you with the coolest uh, gemstones available. So, we're going to continue to be watching these guys daily. Now there's our first caddis who went down underneath the stones there, underneath the leaves. There he is. It's amazing to watch them. After 17 years of doing this, I still never get tired of sitting here and just watching these caddis flies work. It's an amazing process. Uh, God created an incredible insect here, and I'm just hoping that I can um, allow you the opportunity to also enjoy watching these caddisflies as they're constructing their works of art. It's a beautiful thing. Okay, you guys get to work, create some beautiful things.